The Wang Shu Yuan, also known as the Garden of the Master of the Nets, was first built at the end of the Southern Song Dynasty and has a rich history behind its current existence. During the 12th century, the garden was built and purposely designed by Shi Zheng Zi, a prominent scholar and official who craved for the simple pleasures of life. The Garden of the Master of Nets, which stretches across 5,400 meters, sits in the Kangrong district of Suzhou, China, and was abandoned sometime after its construction and later rebuilt and designed by government official Song Zongyuan during the Kailong period of the Qing dynasty. The Wang Shi Yuan has a particularly harmonious and symbiotic relationship with its surroundings. Symbolically, the garden was designed to suggest the detachment of earthly cares, and in context to architecture, the garden is symmetrical to the living quarters, which allows it to have a separate yet unified sense of space. Although the garden is one of the smallest in China, careful design and keen detail force the area to appear dimensionally larger than it is in reality. The garden resembles the large impact that class, social rank, and personal experience have on the elements of architecture. Historically, the garden follows a strict set of regulations that was common during its prime existence. The architectural detail reflects monarchical China through the detailed ornamentation of doors and entryways common to the elite officials. The stark out and interior walls correlate to the official's vision of a space unaffected by the corruption and hastiness of court life. His personal yearning for a simple life as a fisherman rather than a bureaucrat is effectively conveyed through the observer's initial interaction with space. Just as important as the structural feats during the era is the revolutionary symbiosis of landscape and architecture. The path through the garden has a strategic layout with thoughtfully placed natural rock, built corridors, and bridges. The symmetrical plan of the Wang Shi Yuan elevates the harmonious relationship between nature and man through the observer's continuous interaction and sudden revelations of natural beauty in correlation with the simple facade. To me, the Wang Shi Yuan is filled with harmony and purposeful balance between its structure, nature, and human interaction, making this small yet profound landscape one of the finest classical gardens in China.